Now, your KSBW weather forecast with meteorologist Holt Hanley. Good morning. It looks like we will have mostly sunny conditions this weekend with a warm up through Sunday. But I say warm up because today we're still going to experience some of the cool conditions across the central coast. You probably noticed the temperatures come down yesterday. The winds pick up. You could just feel the change in the weather in the air. Now right now it actually looks pretty nice out there though. Clear skies across a lot of the central coast. Calm winds at the moment so the water is nice and glassy. Pretty good morning for a walk with those calm winds. But we are going to see the winds pick up again this afternoon. It shouldn't be as windy as yesterday, but we'll still see some gusts around 20 to even 25 miles per hour. So that will be some factor out there. And then sky conditions, it'll be on and off throughout the day today. Right now, it looks like it is mostly clear out there, but we are going to see some of those clouds move in, especially as we get later in the day. So that'll have some impact on our temperatures as well. Instead of the five to 10 degrees above average temperatures that we had on Tuesday, it now looks like we're about two to 12 degrees below average. So kind of a lot of variation there where the Monterey Peninsula isn't that abnormal today, but then inland areas, that's where we're about 10 to 12 degrees cooler than you would expect this time of the year, which when it comes to the peak of fire season, I would say is good news. Cooler air doesn't pull as much moisture out of your fuels. And then we also have some moisture moving into our fuels right now, just because of that cold front coming through. Up in Northern California, they're even getting some rain. You can actually see that on the forecast rain amounts right here. That green to even yellow shows more than one to two inches in some locations, although notice it's not widespread. It's the very northern parts of the state. For example, this pattern will have very little effect on Southern California's fire danger at all. And then for us, we do have a brief period here where fire danger is decreased, although we will again feel those winds pick up this afternoon. They're at least coming from a good direction. It's not an offshore flow, which pushes in drier air. But again, just back to our forecast highs, mid 70s for our warmest inland location. So pretty comfortable. And then we are going to be warming up as early as tomorrow, but you'll feel more of the warm up as we get into Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. Tuesday should be the hottest day moving forward. Here's your eight day forecast for the coast. We still have a few clouds out there tomorrow. It's kind of the transition day, but then by the beginning of next week, we're back to the warm air and sunshine inland, but not too warm, staying out of the triple digits.